Good morning and welcome to Free Spirit Hippies morning meditation. Um, so we've been going through the chakras um, in the past couple days. And so today we are going to work on balancing the heart chakra. So of course, if there's any blocked energies, you're not as open to love, um, giving love to others, that sense of insecurity, feeling abandoned. Um, so we're, we're going to bring balance to the heart center and open our hearts to the universe. So for this, um, I'm going to do the Padma Mudra. And I'm going to be reading the guided meditation from uh, the Mudra book. And this is the gesture of the lotus. The Padma means lotus. So we're going to place our hands in prayer position. And we're going to connect our pinky and our thumb and allow the, your pointing finger, your middle finger, and your ring finger to open like a lotus flower. I know this may feel a little weird, but that is going to be the gesture that we'll be using for today's meditation. So find a comfortable place to sit. This is not a competition, a seating competition or anything. Um, my knee's been giving me issues, so I'm actually kind of having my leg back. Um, but you can sit however you feel comfortable if you want to lie down, because sitting up um, is too much for you. That is absolutely okay. So we're going to relax, take our shoulders and roll them back, bringing our chest open. Take a few deep breaths here, your natural breaths. We're gonna take our feet and tense up our toes, clench our toes for three, two, one and release. Then we're going to clench our calves for a three, two, one, release. We're going to clench our thighs for three, two, one, relax. We're going to suck in our abdomen for three, Two, one, relax. We're going to lift our diaphragm for three, two, one, relax. Now we're going to raise our shoulders up all the way to our ears and hold for three, two, one, relax. And then we're going to clench all the muscles in the face. Tighten your face, tighten your eyes, your cheeks, your mouth area. For five, four, three, two, one. Now, if you feel any other area in your body where you may have tension, I want you to clench or tighten that area for three, two, one, relax. We're going to roll our shoulders back, sit up nice, straight and tall. Imagine our root chakra grounding into Mother Earth. There are roots coming out, grounding into Mother Earth. And you're allowing the light to enter into the crown of your head. Now we're going to take three cleansing breaths. So you'll inhale. 
Padma Mudra. So again, get your hands in prayer position. And open up hind fingers, middle fingers, and ring fingers. And bring our hand to our heart center. As you hold the Padma Mudra, take several natural breaths to the two to all of the feelings and sensations awakened by this gesture. Notice how your breath is gently directed into your chest and seat of the Anahata Chakra, your center of unconditional love. With each inhaling breath, the frontiers of your heart open gradually and with each exhalation you create a space in which to embrace all your fourth chakra's essential qualities. Visualize your heart center as a fertile field for the blossoming of these qualities. A green meadow filled with the wild flowers of all colors, shapes, and varieties. Take some time to see yourself strolling through the meadow, allowing each flower that you meet to unfold one of your heart's essential qualities. The first flower you meet awakens the quality of lightness of being, your ability to move through life gracefully, savoring its sweetness without taking anything too personally. Take several breaths to envision yourself integrating lightness into all of your activities, allowing you to live with greater ease at each moment along your journey. As you continue through your garden with greater ease, you're drawn to the flower of gratitude allowing you to see that everyone and everything you meet plays an essential role in revealing your life's deeper desire. Take several breaths to sense the color, the texture and fragrance of gratitude, filling your being with deep appreciation to every moment of living. This gratitude fills your being the flower of communion draws you to naturally allow your heart to beat in synchrony with the heart of all beings. Take several breaths to absorb the color and fragrance of communion, envisioning all those whom you share your journey living in greater harmony. As you continue through your garden with a greater sense of communion and harmony, you naturally perceive the flower of compassion unfolding naturally. As compassion unfolds, take some time to offer a heartfelt prayer for the happiness of all beings, recognizing that just like yourself, each one seeks with love within the limits of their understanding. Now embrace all of the flowers of your heart as a single bouquet, allowing unconditional love to blossom naturally as your essential fragrance to your true being. Affirm your heart's qualities, repeating the following three times aloud or silently. 
awakening my heart's essential qualities. Unconditional love blossoms naturally. Awakening my heart's essential qualities. Unconditional love blossoms naturally. Awakening my heart's essential qualities. Unconditional love blossoms naturally. Slowly release the gesture, taking several breaths to sense and awaken of all of your heart essential, uh, your heart chakras essential qualities. Take a few more breaths here. Inhale. And exhale. One more. And exhale. When you are ready, open your eyes and return slowly and gently. Bringing the colors and fragrance of your inner garden into all of your activities. Thank you for joining me in today, July 12th, morning meditation with Free Spirit Hippie. May you bring love, light, and wisdom. Bring our hands to our mouths to remind us to have clear and loving communication. Bring our hands to our heart to remind us to have clear and loving intentions. Bring our hearts to our head to remind us to have clear love Namaste. Mm -hmm.